All through the media, pundits and politicians are telling falsehoods, which manipulate the public into accepting a confrontation with Iran. That's not true. What he said was, the Imam said, this regime occupying Jerusalem must vanish from the page of time. All through the media, this lie about him supposedly saying he wants to wipe Israel off the map has been spread. In fact, media outlets like CBS with their show 60 Minutes have suppressed what the Iranian president has said clearly. This is the part they broadcast where the president said, I think that the Israeli government is a fabricated government. The part in yellow here is what they omitted from the telecast. The reason I know what they said was the whole video was shown on C-SPAN, but an edited version was shown on 60 Minutes, and they omitted everything that you see here, where he talks about what a solution is. The solution is democracy. He explains that Palestinian people to participate in a free and fair referendum to express their views. And he talks about peace, that this solution serves the cause of a durable peace. These are facts that 60 Minutes didn't want you to know. They just edited it out. This is the way journalists behave in America. People need to understand this. There's a history of the media fabricating statements and suppressing statements. Please see the link to the right for background information about that fact, about the fact of what the Iranian president actually said about what Israel has actually been doing to Palestinians, about Israeli soldiers intentionally killing children. The bottom line is Palestinians are denied rights that we as Americans expect for ourselves. That basic fact has not been communicated by the media.